Andy Russell, your host of Praise Connection TV. Thank you for joining in today. We're going to be speaking today with Luke Gamble from Integrity Music. Also, we'll be interviewing Toddy Funk, Toby Mac's bass player. And you will want to join in and stay tuned because we're going to be premiering the video for my new release, You Are Holy. Thanks for watching Praise Connection TV. Hello and thank you for watching Praise Connection TV. Today we have Luke Gamble from Integrity Music and he's here today and he's going to share with us about what the Lord is doing through Integrity Music and, and through his life in general. Thank you, Luke. Well, it's, it's great to be with you, Sandy. Thank this you. is, a, a, this is a, a great honor to be with you guys here in Florida. I don't get to Florida very often, right. but uh, a, a great joy and to be here, you can probably see behind us, the stage at Christ Fellowship, right. and uh, I'm sure we'll be talking a little bit about why we're here, but uh, it is a joy, and uh, thank, thank you. you for the invitation. Thank you. Tell us, Luke, why are you here today at well, Christ Fellowship? I, I'm here this weekend. We're doing a recording project. Uh, it's sort of a multi-artist project, and one of the artists is Christ Fellowship, mm -hmm. and the, the other artists that will be on the project will be uh, two other, well, kind of three other integrity artists, one being uh, Michael Neal, the worship pastor here at Christ Fellowship. The others will be Ross Parsley mm -hmm. at New Life in Colorado Springs, and the other will be Paul, Paul Balosh, who wrote the song that many people are probably familiar with, Open the Eyes of My Heart. Yes, yes. And um, so Paul is recording this week at uh, his studio in Texas, uh, and Ross is recording this week in Colorado, and I'm here recording this week in Florida, and next week we'll bring it all back together in Integrity Studios, get it back to Nashville to mix, and then we'll go to release uh, about mid-year. Now, what type of a project is this? This is a Christmas project. Um, as, as you, and as you would expect from Integrity, it's a worship project, though. It's great songs that, that uh, edify our God and think about when He came to earth and was, was birthed uh, as a child. And so it's, it's songs in Christmas in nature, mm -hmm. but uh, it has that definite praise and worship contemporary style that you expect from Integrity. Awesome. So, yeah, some great uh, solos, but in the background, that 150 voice right. Christ Fellowship Choir. Amazing. So. It's, it's, it's been an awesome experience. Uh, last two nights of recording had just been huge. Awesome. And um, so what a blessed church to have this choir. Yes, for sure. absolutely a blessed church and a blessed ministry. So tell us, now Christ Fellowship also has uh, recorded another um, project with Integrity. Tell us yes, about that one. I, I was here, maybe it was a year and a half ago or so, and we recorded a, a live project here at Christ Fellowship called Bigger Than Life. Okay and featured, um, I think of 13 songs, 10 of the songs was written by Michael Neal, mm -hmm. worship pastor, a great prolific songwriter here yes. at Christ Fellowship. Yes. And, uh, and as a result of that project, and many people catching on to it, loving it, buying it, and using it in, with their own choirs, mm -hmm. it is now up for a Dove nomination wow. this year. Wow. And um, up there with uh, some other home run hitters, and awesome. Uh, awesome. I'm hoping all of our right. good friends out there want to take a look at that <laughs> and check that out as, as, the, their, as their voting. Uh, I can't tell you as a GMM member that you have to vote for it, but I can <laughs> recommend projects. Uh, and uh, th that's a great one. And it's had some huge success out there at various churches and ministries and Christian bookstore shelves. You can still buy it out at your local Christian bookstore. Just go look for Bigger Than Life and uh, you'll find it there. Awesome. So, awesome. yeah, uh, awesome. it's done very, very well. Well, we're hoping for really great things from that project. Uh, yes, yes. And what else do you do at Integrity? What exactly well, is your position? At, at Integrity, I am uh, the creative manager for worship resources. Mm -hmm. And essentially what that means is I, I'm in charge of the creative process for anything that's created and geared for the local church, be it choral music or choir music, um, kids musicals, software, mm -hmm. uh, anything for your orchestra, praise team, uh, that type of thing. Uh, that's where I think and live and breathe is in that realm. Uh, we have the Integrity Label Group that focuses more on the artist projects, mm -hmm. be it um, Israel Houghton right. or Paul Balash, things like that. Mm -hmm. And I will help create some ancillary products to what they're doing there. But awesome. primarily, I have the joy, and, I, and I, to me it is a joy, of thinking about the local worship leader, 
that choir director, and I focus on the projects for them. And that's when this project that uh, I'm here for this weekend, when it initially releases, that's its initial goal is a resource product, mm -hmm. getting it out to local worship leaders, choir directors, uh, with the hopes and anticipation that they'll use it with their local church choirs and worship teams and orchestras and so forth. Coming up next, more with Luke Gamble, a few minutes with Tawny Funk, and my new video, You Are Holy. I don't want to go to church with cute people who just want to have cute little services. I believe it's time for people who are desperate for a move of God to rise up in this nation and say we will not be denied. We want the power of God like we've never seen before, and we're hungry for more of Him. I so So overwhelming. The value of a dream yes, can only be determined by the price you're willing to pay for it. Thanks for watching Praise Connection TV. Join us next week for an all new show. If you're an artist or ministry interested in being featured on Praise Connection TV, give us a call at 561-694-0212 or visit us on the web at www.praiseconnection.tv. Hi, I'm Pastor Richard Scott of New Light Fellowship in West Palm Beach. And this is my lovely wife, Cassandra. We're located at 5829 Corporate Way, and our phone number is 478-4031. Come out and be with us on Sunday mornings at 11 o'clock for lively praise and worship and the preaching of the Word. We're an international church serving wonderful people who love the Lord, and you will get to know Him like we know Him. God bless you. Come be with us at The Light. Yeah, the last year or so has been filled with uh, just slamming with Toby Mac uh, with the release of the new record, Welcome to Diverse City. Holy Ghost. In a couple weeks, we kick up with the Winter Wonder Slam tour. Uh, and then we go into Winter Jam in January. So even though we're not as busy as we were, we're getting ready to be busy again. So. Take those shackles off your mind. Fucking soul salvation time. A lot of it musically, you know, Toby dips into a lot of different genres and uh, his R&B core is kind of where I'll take it a step further because the music that really grabbed me when I was, was growing up was R&B and funk music. As a bass player, funk music was just uh, really bass dominant, so there were a lot of things that bass players could get their hands on that, you know, stretch things out and brought bass players to the forefront of music. But it still didn't forsake the pop sensibilities and the aspect of dance. Um, so what Electric Church has done is taken that, that whole uh, vibe from, say, like a Cameo or uh, Commodores or Earth, Wind and & Fire or P-Funk and, and has, has uh, combined it with the Holy Ghost element. It's a Holy Ghost Hopefully, just broadening the whole CCM and gospel spectrum, the mission statement is loving Christ with all your heart and keeping Him the center of your focus and uh, keeping all things funky for sure, you know. <laughs> That's how we do it, man. Yeah. You've been fearfully and wonderfully made in God's own image, and Christ is real. And in your everyday life, you can project that without coming off as preachy, and you can still be as cool as you want to be and still let people know that you're a believer and you have uh, firm convictions that you believe in and that you won't waver from. You can catch me at www.lawtonerecords.com. Hey, people in TV land, you're watching Praise Connection TV. Keep it locked. It's a holy ghost name. 
Now, what else do you do as far as your ministry, your personal ministry? Are you involved in other ministries other than integrity? Well, you know, it's uh, integrity keeps me so busy, mm -hmm. I think, that every now and then I'll get a call from someone wanting me to come speak at a, uh, be at a choir conference or this clinic or what have you, and I'll try to fit those things in. I'll play keyboards for various um, conferences with various worship leaders and artists. Mm -hmm. uh, that's my main instrument, keyboard. Right. Mm -hmm. And um, so I, I get to get out every so often, but Interity keeps me so busy with right. what I'm doing with resources that uh, that's, that's kind of tough. But uh, <laughs> I enjoy it when I get to do it. Right. That, that is fun. Yeah. Awesome. Well, so. is there anything else that you would like to share with us? Well, um, let's see, about four or five months ago, uh, my neighborhood was, was ravaged with Hurricane Katrina. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's a shame that the, the media at large has seemed to now forgotten about it. Mm -hmm. And I, my home, though I work at Integrity, which is in Mobile, Alabama, right. my home is in Biloxi, mm -hmm. Mississippi. Mm -hmm. And so I'm right down there in the heart of it. Mm -hmm. And um, so my home was severely flooded. Uh, most of my neighborhood was, was, is gone. Mm -hmm and most of my choir members, because I'm also a local worship pastor right. myself, um, lost so much. So I'll just encourage everyone to continue to keep right. that part of the world with us and South Louisiana, New Orleans, continue to keep us in your prayers because it's not over. There's still a lot that has to be done. And so just continue thinking about us, praying for us, and whatever support you, you feel led to do to various ministries or support groups, uh, continue to do that because it's not over and and now there's fears and worry because we're entering into the the 2006 hurricane season uh, again and everybody's not rehabilitating right right there's right. still so much debris everywhere mm -hmm. and people are just now getting to where they feel like they can begin to overcome this thing right. and so potentially here it comes again right. Right. so uh, just keep us in your prayers there we'll definitely keep that in prayer thank you and you who are watching please continue to keep that in prayer. Now Luke, what is worship to you? Wow, you know, that, that could open up a whole encyclopedia there. <laughs> uh, what is worship? Well, let me back up a little bit from there and say I, I work for a company that Mike Coleman, who is the, the head uh, of, of Integrity Music, actually Integrity Media, the parent company, and we're one of the, the sister companies within Integrity Media is Integrity Music. And Mike Coleman, will remind us every so often when we have corporate worship times. Mm -hmm. uh, he'll say, uh, guys, I want to remind you that first of all, this company is a ministry, yeah. but to keep the ministry going, we have to make money <laughs> to keep the ministry going. Okay. Um, so the, the company is, is founded upon worship. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's 20 years old now, roughly, and uh, what a blessing to be a part of that. But worship can be just as simply you know, thinking about um, and focusing on the good things of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you can express that in so many, so many right. different ways. And I'm sure a lot of our friends watching mm -hmm. here today have various ways that they express that love and their gratitude for God mm -hmm. in their hearts. And I'm blessed to be in so many different kinds of churches uh, across the country and to experience so many different types of worship expressions right. that, uh, you know, I think my box is just a little bit bigger than others. I probably still have God in the box, but mine's a lot bigger now. Uh, but, uh, you know, I think I've lived my life for worship. Mm -hmm. It's just, mm -hmm. you know, and it's not always about, or hardly ever about what God has done for you. It's just simply because of who He is mm -hmm. and the awesomeness of who He is and the fact that, and I, I tell my choir this, I tell them, I, I try to remind them that you know, as, as we lead our congregation today in worship, mm -hmm. that it's not because we have to or the Word tells us to. It's because we get to. Mm, that we have this chance to come before the Almighty God, mm -hmm. to lift our voices, to clap our hands, to even dance nice. if you're at that kind of church, to mm -hmm. do that, to play those instruments. And I say, you know, it's because we get to. Right. And who I learned that from was Israel Houghton. I was at a conference and Israel said that and it just struck a chord with wow. me. And I thought, 
That's right. So it's to. because I get to. Right. It's a privilege. I, yes. Yes. Not because I'm prompted to right. or because right. I grew up doing it, mm -hmm. but it's a privilege to That's lift great. up the name of God. Amen. Uh, so, yeah, I, I, I think just my life is all about that. Mm -hmm. Whatever facet I'm working in, be it creating product or at the church, um, directing the choir and the worship team, mm -hmm. you know, always encouraging others and always stretching others to get beyond that box that you're in and, and find that place of intimacy. Awesome. Whatever that is for you, right. uh, get there mm -hmm. and hang out there. Uh, and God will love you for it. Uh, again, because it's a privilege uh, and you get to do it. No matter, it, you know, and that's, that's the good thing is no matter what country you're in, no matter what bondage you're under, no matter what man says you can and cannot yes. do, yes. you can always, even if it's in your mind, right. you can always enter in and worship that's God right. because you get to. You get to. Not because you're told to, but you get to. That's awesome. Yeah. I'm Paige Hemis with Extreme Makeover Home Edition. You're watching Praise Connection TV. In today's business world, image is everything. You can't afford to be second best. New Vision Media Group offers high quality, affordable video production services so you can stand shoulders above the rest. Now, there are no excuses. Visit our website today for more information or call 561-694-0212.
In today's business world, image is everything. You can't afford to be second best. New Vision Media Group offers high quality, affordable video production services so you can stand shoulders above the rest. Now, there are no excuses. Visit our website today for more information or call 561-694-0212. church with cute people who just want to have cute little services. I believe it's time for people who are desperate for a move of God to rise up in this nation and say we will not be denied. We want the power of God like we've never seen before and we're hungry for more of Him. I so very lovely and so The value of a dream can only be determined by the price you're willing to pay for it. I know that there's someone watching today that has been just completely blessed by what you've been saying. Can you just share a word of encouragement or lead us in a short prayer? Sure. Love that. Yeah, you're probably watching today and 
maybe you turned, tuned into this program for the first time and you don't know my face from Adam. But let me encourage you today because I can stand here today and declare the goodness of God because of all that me and my family have been through, all of those in my church have been through, all of those families affected at Integrity Music have been through, uh, not only from Hurricane Katrina, but just from the various trials and tribulations of life. And you can always stand firm on that scripture that says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So let me pray for you today. Oh, Heavenly Father, most gracious one, the highest in all the earth, Lord, I come to you this day and I, I want to bless each and every person that's watching this program today. Lord, I, I don't know that uh, all, all that they're going through, but, but you do. And so, Lord, I pray that you would just reach down to their circumstance, even right now, Lord, and make things right, the things that they see that are wrong, yes. oh God. And I, I think about a song that says, when the oceans rise and the thunders roar, I will soar with you above the storm. So I pray that over these, these wonderful folks that are watching this day that may be downtrodden, they may have family members who are lost, family members who are, who are in drugs, family members who, they don't even know where they're at. But God, I just pray that they would hear prompting of the Holy Spirit and hear your voice, oh God, and come running back after you. Give them peace, assurance, and comfort that all will be well, that they will stand firm in your word and believe that. In Jesus' amen. name, amen. Amen, 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 amen. That was wonderful. Thank you so much. It's such a oh, blessing to have you, you here, Luke. Joy to be here. Thank you. Joy to be here. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching Praise Connection TV. We hope that you've enjoyed the show today and were tremendously blessed. Please visit our website at www.praiseconnection.tv and let us know what you think about the show. Thank you and may God bless you. Don't you know you're taking back the dance floor, baby? Thanks for watching Praise Connection TV. Join us next week for an all new show. If you're an artist or ministry interested in being featured on Praise Connection TV, give us a call at 561 694 0212 or visit us on the web at www.praiseconnection.tv.